friends, it's me. And today we're checking out some people who got stuck in some weird places. Mother wouldn't give her a dollar to get a pack of Skittles, so she literally crawled into the vending machine. I didn't even know this was possible. Kids literally would do anything for candy. I would be lying if as a child, I haven't tried to stick an entire arm up a vending machine to try to get something out of it. But this kid literally went in there. Congratulations, now you got the candy. Now you gotta keep putting dollars in in hopes that the kid will come out. This dude was in a playground. And then he heard little bro over here oh. crying for help. Gap. He holding off for dear life. It's like a few inches. Oh, there's somebody. Oh. Oh, there we go. <laughs> the aerial view. I feel like if he just turned his head to the side, he can just drop down. No. Look how he's stuck in there. Like this is something that would happen in a cartoon. Come on, just grab him by the arms, just pull him up. <laughs> there you go. He definitely came out a few inches longer than when he went in. He got mad at an employee and tried throwing the cart, and this is how it ended. <laughs> no, this is so embarrassing, and now they're gonna leave him dangling here. You must be humiliated for your crimes. You know, nothing like public humiliation in the 21st century. You know what? I can see. I can see how he tried to, like, go into the cart and grab it and try to flip it, but ended up flipping himself. Congratulations, buddy. Instant karma at its finest. I wouldn't even help him either. Oh no, somebody's cat got stuck with the coke. <laughs> cat sees hole, cat goes through. Cat is now stuck. Nothing satisfies the thirst like some ice cold cat. She got stuck in the washing machine. And I guess Big Bro never came to help her out. So then the police were called. Like we really got cops here. <laughs> It doesn't even look like a whole person is in there, just a floating booty. Oh, they pushed her in. Oh, there is a person in there. Oh, okay, now there's a leg. Well, I still haven't seen a head yet. Ugh. Okay, you know what, just get the foot out. Once you get the foot out, then you'll be good. You can get the rest of them out. Pull it out. Like ripping a drumstick off the rotisserie. Come on, let's go. A single foot. Ah, I feel like she likes it in there. She dilly-dallying. Oh, okay, there we go. One foot out, then the other one. Now we're tired. In. Okay, so if you ever get stuck in a washing machine, you get the legs out first. Then grab the legs and just pull! Yank it out! I'm sick and tired of her. Oh, wow. What a waste of the police's time and our tax dollars. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. How did she get in there? There ain't no way. She spawned in there. This is so confusing. Like, did somebody just take her and just put her in? I'm trying to look around there is absolutely no way. She could have gotten this. I am so confused right now. How do you get stuck in here? This is quite the bad spawn. I can't stop laughing at the video my little sister sent in my niece. She's just trapped behind a locked door, right? Uh, <laughs> She's in the block. And kids are so gullible, you can just tell her she's part of the door now. No more iPad, no more Coco Melon, only door duties. These videos give me such bad anxiety. Like exploring a cave. Yeah, and getting stuck in a cave. You know, why would you want to do this? People do this for fun. Oh my god. Some people play video games for fun. Some people race cars, go shopping, eat good food. This dude gets sandwiched in between two rocks for fun? Did no one hug you as a child? Is the warmth and embrace of a human not enough? You had to explore the world's skinniest cave. I don't know if I can watch all of this. I really hope he gets out at the end, like... I feel like I'm gonna get stuck. You don't say. <sighs> Bro's out of breath and stuck. You know what, just leave me there. Oh, it's on the other side, there's an opening. I can see it, on the other side. You know, as soon as you get past that... So, the reason I kept pushing is I thought it was gonna get wider. But as I'm getting closer, I realize it's an illusion. The water was just so calm and still above me that it was reflecting the ceiling off and it just looked like a way bigger space. But it's continuing to narrow down. Uh, um, I don't I, like that. I don't I like it one bit. You know what, is it too day. late to turn around? I mean, he must be alive if they got this video. I'm gonna attempt to turn back around. I don't 
don't care if there's a room full of pirate treasure on the other side. I don't even care if the One Piece is on the other side. You could not force me to do this. This girl gets stuck on a slide above the ocean. So I know these crazy slides on a cruise ship. Isn't there supposed to be water in there? Why is it so dry? Ugh. Okay, all you have to do is like shimmy on down. You know, this is why they wait for the first person to come out before they launch the next person. Imagine someone coming out and just like yeeting you in the head. Okay, I would be terrified of like falling back the other way. I'm not gonna lie, these slides are kind of scary. This cat thinks he is stuck. What is he doing? You know, for such smart animals, cats are real idiots. Like, bro is terrified. How is he sitting like this? It's like he's defying gravity. Where is the other paw? Kinda look like he's about to be made into a sandwich. And what a distinguished gentleman. Watch this guy fly right into a screen door and ran over to help. I'm just gonna... Is that a hawk? Okay. Okay. That is one big bird. Movies. It's okay. He has literal talons and you're just holding them with your hands? Okay, so you're gonna have to put those could rip you apart. I'm down for this. Buddy. Yeah, personally I would not. She talking to it like it's a little hamster. Poor thing, let me help you. Is that better? It's okay. <laughs> no, don't be mad at me. Okay, we gotta let go of this one too though, okay? He just flew right into a screen door. Better? Let go, buddy. It's okay. You're good, buddy. Take a break. It's okay. <laughs> You're okay. He having a rough day. His tongue hanging out of his mouth. Oh, he looks like he's about to scream. With every dangerous animal in need, there is a woman dying to help out for a TikTok. The face he's making, he is in disbelief. Like, she really just did that. You know, I could claw your face off right now, lady. Gonna stay, oh, okay? the dog is being so no. well behaved. It's okay, buddy. Promise you do oh. your thing. <laughs> You're okay. <laughs> he just waited there with his wings spread. Do you think he's asking for a hug? Come back here. I don't think he's capable of that. I can't believe she just rescued him and now she's on her merry way. This kid got his entire head stuck in one of these chairs. I feel like they banned these chairs in kindergarten classrooms for this very reason. You already know, if they see a hole that's about the size of their head, there is a good chance they will try to stick it in. Time to teach Billy a lesson. Let him walk around with it for the rest of the day. A little idiot hat. Something tells me she wasn't using those bands correctly. How does it end up up your butt crack? Come on, it's not that hard. Just pull them off and step out of it like some pants. You know, you're using a barbell for probably squats. Why do you have a band on it? We had to get an innocent bystander involved. Remove the band, okay. Someone tell her she's lost band privileges. You don't need that for squatting. My neighbor's dog smells the chicken I'm grilling. <laughs> No, because I have one of these on my balcony. I am so scared of my dogs like sticking their snout through it. They are tiny dogs. They might be able to like go through it, but that's a big dog. But all he can do is watch. It's like torturing the dog. He can smell chicken. He can see chicken, but he can't eat chicken. I'm not gonna let you chillins have all the fun. She jumped into the foam pit. Oh, <laughs> she got stuck. And we have two guys helping pull her out. You know, these things are usually for kids for a reason. You know, I hate to see the chillins have all the fun. I don't think Deborah's gonna be jumping in any foam pits anytime soon. This happens way more than you would think. The swings at a public playground, they are meant for the butt of a toddler. They might not look it, but the seats are very small. It's not meant to accommodate a full-size badonk. I feel like this is the fire department's part-time job to pull out people stuck in awkward places like this. Bro, I would be so embarrassed. I'd rather walk out that park pantsless than have to inconvenience the fire department by coming to rescue my butt out of this tire. A bird got stuck in the grill of their car. Oh, they just pulled him out. Oh, he good. Oh, is that a turkey? <laughs> Bro just dipped. He was embarrassed. Do not record me. Oh, this is so embarrassing. He can't have his friends see that. This cat's head got stuck in the floor. Yes. Where is the rest of the cat? She really stuck. Oh my god, I'm so scared. Oh no, isn't that good? How did this even happen? This dude reached this deep into a Pringles can and got it tattooed. Okay, so she's gonna do the same thing. Something tells me she should be old enough to know that this was not <laughs> nope. a good idea. <laughs> common sense is just not so common. 
Relax your soul, relax your body. Let's get her done. <laughs> Pardon me? I feel like you have to like lube it up, slather it in some oil. Okay, we got it out. Whew. Okay, all of that for a tattoo idea. Mission accomplished. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button, the fist, and make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodies, shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe to the Wolfpack. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.